As this Christian Holy Week continues, we are tracking every new development out of Paris after the fire at the historic Notre Dame Cathedral. Now, from the standpoint of the investigation, they say it looks like an electrical short circuit may have started that fire. Meanwhile, we are hearing more and more stories from people with Houston ties who are closely connected to the cathedral. Channel 2's Jacob Rascone live in Paris tonight. And Jacob, you have the story of an organist who played at that sacred site. Yeah, Bill and Dominique, that organist with strong Houston ties, Johan Vexo, was playing for the choir right before the fire alarm sounded, and he was one of the last to evacuate. The only thing better than playing an organ in a cathedral for Johan Vexo is playing the world's most famous organ in the Notre Dame, which is now Johan's former job. It's still hard. I wasn't brave enough to go there to see. When the fire alarm sounded at Notre Dame, Johan was inside playing for the choir. He was one of the last to evacuate and refused to watch. No. I stayed there one, two minutes, and I left. You couldn't? No. It was unbearable. Unbearable for so many in France and around the world, but Johan was there nearly every day for 15 years. Playing organ at Notre Dame, it's just an amazing experience. The sound of this instrument, it just, you cannot describe it. His talents have taken him around the world and across the United States, starting in Houston. I was there for teaching a uh, master class uh, at Rice University, um, which is, I think, one of the most beautiful organs in the U.S. Uh, it's a wonderful instrument. The thought of never playing the world's most famous organ again was as bitter as the realization the instrument had been saved was sweet. It's just unbelievable, <laughs> incredible. Uh, it's very loud, so you have all these different possibilities. Um, it's the biggest organ in France um, with unlimited possible musical possibilities on it. And cleaning and evaluating that massive 8,000 pipe organ will be painstaking. Johan says that alone could take two years. Live in Paris, I'm Jacob Brascone. Bill and Dominique, back to you. 